I think, I think I, where I came from, I probably got involved in politics because I was kind of a popular guy. I employed, I had two or three businesses. I employed uh, 30 people in the town of Boyle. I was involved in the Roscommon GS, the Borkless Club. I was, let's say, I got around. Mm. And I suppose people in Fine Gael said, God, we'd like him as a candidate in 1999. I got elected to the council in 99. We got the best result. At the time, nearly in the history of Fine Gael, we got four out of five in the local elections and then they said, look, would he not go for the general election? So I suppose I got involved in politics by being uh, an activist is probably the wrong word, but I was always there doing things as involved in chamber commerce and doing things on the ground. So when I got involved in politics, I felt that I was liked. But an issue like this sometimes defines, you know, I suppose the, the more fundamental things in life, it's, it's, um, uh, it, 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 it brings back to you lose your good name. And once you lose it, it took me about two years to understand you know, the, the veracity, uh, the fact that I was a scapegoat, that my life had changed. Mm. Uh, I've come to terms with that and uh, I believe it's not about being popular, it's about making the right decisions and I now look back on it that to me the right decisions have been made and I know that history will judge me kindly. Now, if I didn't represent two counties, I wouldn't know. Mm. You know, I, I represent Leitrim as well and I'd be in Ballinamore and people would say, how are you Frank and Carrick and Shannon. When I go to other towns uh, where it was near where the hospital issue, although the place is busier and safer and everyone says that, you could see that they made their mind up four years ago. And to be honest, I made my mind up three years ago that I wasn't going for election. So, okay. but you, 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 I suppose you learn what, uh, you come to terms that the, the simple things in life are free, that it's about doing the right thing and not about being popular because we had loads of popular leaders over the years, but we found ourselves in a situation in 2011 that maybe we needed to take, make the right decisions. And I'm absolutely convinced that dozens and dozens of people are alive today with the decision I made in Roscommon, and not one person has died because Roscommon E&E has been downgraded. And, uh, and I know that in years to come, you'll have every other politician claiming credit for these things, but I know why it's there, because I stayed in government.